The NGC Group recorded an unaudited after-tax profit of $1 billion TT dollars for the reporting nine-month period ended September 30, 2021. State company says this represents a 2,588% increase over the loss of $42 million for the same period last year. Revenues for the period stood at $15.6 billion TT dollars as compared with $8.1 billion TT dollars in 2020, an increase of 98% over last year. Chairman of NGC Conrad Ennell speaking with MCTV News says the profits represent the company mitigating risk as well as stability in gas prices. We have been able to provide them with contracts um, for the long term and we think that going forward, as long as the prices as they are, the NGC will continue to be profitable and the risk to the revenue stream or the risk to losses, as we would have seen in 2020, uh, will be eliminated. In the short term, we expect that we will continue to be profitable and we will continue to have some challenges, but we will manage those challenges. As the new year comes, the NGC chairman says it will be looking to work with the government in reducing the company's burden through subsidies offered through TN Tech, while the company has its eyes on unitization of Atlantic LNG. Is, is Can you continue uh, to use gas in that way, especially where you have alternatives? And what we would want to discuss with the government, and we've started as, uh, already, is the whole question of the alternative energy so that we can use the gas differently. And, and we expect to do that in uh, 2022. A couple of things are going to change. Um, the government is involved in discussions on the Atlantic unitization issue. One train, two train, three trains, four trains. But the fact is that the government felt that we were not, as a country, yet any kind of benefit. And, you know, they've been looking at that for a very long time.